السلام علیکم وی آر ٹاکنگ اباؤٹ وومین ویئرنگ ہجاب اٹس ویری نائس بٹ نو ڈیز وی سی مین ٹائٹ جینس کلوتھ وچ ایون مین ڈیئر ناٹ سی دی ادر مین ڈو وی ہیو سم تھنگ یو لائک ٹو سی فار دی وومین فار دی مین فوک دیٹ not put only the women in hijab but we have certain morals to follow for the society jazakallah khair alhamdulillah but the talk you have to understand the talk was not uh, you know how men should behave in islam as usual you know the talk is always about women in islam and i'm the first person to say that we need many talks on teaching men how to behave especially to their wives uh, i'm not the i'm the first person to admit that um, but since the brother asked the question of course you know as just as the woman should uh, dress in a decent manner and a modest manner that is the same thing for the men and there are some conditions and some correct way for the men to dress and that is that the man first of all we mentioned should grow his beard it is not a sunnah it is fard to grow the beard the prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam the prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam ordered the men to grow the beard and what the prophet ordered is the same as what allah ordered and this is what allah said in the quran whatever the messenger gives you take it and whatever he orders you to leave leave it and the prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam said what i tell you to do is like what allah tells you to do there's no difference because the prophet did not speak from his mind he didn't invent it when the prophet ordered us something from the religion it's because jibril came to him and told him that this is from the religion so the messenger sallallahu alaihi wasallam ordered the man to grow the beard shaving the beard is part of imitating the women it's effeminate the first people to do it were the people of lut and you know who they were yes so growing the beard is part of the dress of the man also the man should cover himself from his navel to his knee and the clothing should not show his shape of his body This is what is obligatory for the man to sh- from the navel to the knee and his garment should not trail below his ankle his lower garment should not trail below his ankles because what is in below the ankles is in the hellfire so this is the correct dress for the male if he wears more than that especially when he is praying if he has something he should also cover his shoulders But as long as he is covering from the navel to the knee he's growing his beard keeping his trousers above the ankle and it is loose fitting this is the requirement for the men's dress and for long